One word to describe girl soccer. Intense. Exciting. Aggressive. Amazing. Supportive. Dedication. Um, well, we're 4-0 right now, so we're expecting to win a lot more games, and we want to go the season undefeated, and I'm really excited for the rest of the season. Um, my goals for the upcoming season is to go undefeated and to possibly win the league. Um, first is to win the league, and then it's to win the section. I think we're looking to compete in the league. Uh, I think we're uh, looking to be competitive in all our independent games. We have a lot of seniors coming back, a lot of experience. Uh, so the league is our main goal, and then you know from there we're going to look to compete in the state tournament and hopefully take home a sectional or, or be competitive in that. Um, the way we prepare differently is that this year, like since the turf was closed off in the summer, we like practiced a lot on trap again, which like helped us like work on the grass fields, which we normally struggle with. It, like I said before, we had a lot coming back. We have a lot of seniors, so it was just a matter of getting those seniors used to playing with those underclassmen. Um, you know, we had a really good summer of preparation. Uh, it was just a matter of getting the girls to play together and get comfortable pl uh, playing together. Uh, that was really the only thing that we really needed to do, uh, the talents there, and it's just getting them to come together as a team. Um, we're taking everything one step at a time, which is something we didn't do last year, and I think it's really working. Um, I think we were really prepared for the season because we have a really experienced team. We have like 14 seniors, everyone's played on varsity before, so I think we have a lot of experience. So who are some players to look out for on the varsity girls soccer team? Um, I would say the defensive line, like Tara, Lauren, Devin, and Danielle, because a lot of times they don't get the recognition that they deserve, but they are a big key in us winning games this year. I definitely think the three captains, Haley Larson, Maddie Archer, and Lauren Tulin, they have been um, pre um, returning varsity athletes, and I definitely think they're going to make a breakthrough this year. Um, I, would, I would also say the defensive line. That's good. <laughs> Stay with me, the defense. Um, our toughest opponent, um, we actually already versed was Park Ridge, and we won. But yeah, I think when we verse them again, it's going to be even harder. Park Ridge. And why? Um, because last year we beat them one time, and then they beat us one time, and we just beat them again this year, so they're going to be out to get us again. We're in a really tough league. Uh, Park Ridge is very good. Emerson's very good. Midland Park's very good. I think in the league, those are our three toughest opponents. And then, you know, in terms of the state, yeah, teams like Mountain Lakes, Pompton Lakes, Kenelon, good teams. We're in a really tough section this year. So, uh, you know, I think we have the team and the talent to do it, and, and we're looking forward to it. Out of you three, who's the worst player on the team? Haley. Thank you. Haley? Okay. <laughs> what? No, we said who's the best player. We said who's the best. No, we said best. Who's the best player. What's one word to describe boy soccer? Family. Family. Familia. Family. Family. Familia. Well, the goals for the season is going to be what we always shoot for. We want to win the league title. That's our number one priority. If that goes well, we'd like to earn a high seed for the states and make a good run in the states. And. Uh, represent our school in the counties. That's what we want to do. Our goal is the same every year. Basically, we want to win the league, win the section, win the county, win the states. Win the league, then the section, and then the whole thing. So, win the whole thing. <laughs>